Northwest Wednesday, you're invited to an evening of good food, fun, and celebration as Nashville recording artist, artist Jameson Rogers returns to his alma mater, Northwest Mississippi Community College. Here to share all of that is Ms. Patty Gordon. She's the executive director of Northwest Foundation and the Alumni Association. Showcasing this event. Hey, Patty. Hey, Gina. How you doing? I'm doing great. You know what I love about Northwest? What's that? Y'all always look out for your alma mater. Y'all hired teachers back in when they've been students. Mm -hmm. Now you're bringing another person back for the entertainment. Let's talk about it. So okay. he now he's a country West, he's a country singer. That's right. He is originally from Batesville, Mississippi, and he is originally a, a baseball alumnus yeah. of the college. And he is an up and coming country music singer uh, out of Nashville, Jameson Rogers. And he will be performing along with some other songwriters from Nashville, kind of like a singer songwriter. Nashville oh, round I love uh, that. type of entertainment. Which exactly explains the Boots and Pearls. Boots and Pearls. <laughs> it's called the Northwest Soiree Boots and Pearls. We're very excited about oh, that event. That. It's going to be real fun uh, to, to be a part of that. And they must wear Boots and Pearls. They don't have to. But we to, want you. But know, you got to participate. That's right. That's right. Yeah. It, it's a formal event. So okay. we will be dressed up in oh. our formal attire, but then you can have fun with it in wearing your boots and pearls. Oh, that makes it comfortable. Exactly. I know the ladies are like, yeah! And it'll make it fun. <laughs> and it make it fun. It's That's easy. right. That's right. So this is your, is this the first new one? I think, is this you guys' Second. first? Second, Second soiree? Okay. Last year was our first inaugural, our inaugural soiree, and it was so successful, and we had such a great time that we wanted to bring it back. Uh, and it is and will continue to be an annual fundraiser fundraiser for the So it's a foundation. fundraiser for the, okay, right. for the foundation. That's now, right. is it mostly students or do you kind of get all kind of audience? Oh, all kind of audience. And okay. um, let me just kind of go through sure. uh, yeah, yeah. a flow of the night and what will happen is we start with a, a social, a social hour and we come together in the Heindel Center for the Performing Arts. So mm -hmm. that is our new, new yep. Performing Arts Center there on the Cenotopia campus. And we gather in the lobby, have a social hour. Uh, we have uh, lots of great food. Um, we will have a silent auction oh, okay. going on. And our auction actually starts a few days even before the event because oh, it's online. Perfect. So anyone can participate in the online auction. Do you, uh, can you share little things that you've already gotten or you want to kind of keep it? Oh, I can share a few share things. A few. We, we have some great trips Ooh. that people can bid on. Um, some stays uh, for some condos down uh, in Florida. And we also have some autographed sports memorabilia oh. that will be real exciting and fun to bid on but again um, you don't have to be attend to see all of those awesome items uh, to bid and again all of those funds raised from the auction will help with our fundraiser uh, the soiree. Nice. And then also that night um, as we're the in the social hour mm -hmm. eventually we will go into the auditorium of the Heindel Center for the awards ceremony oh. and I'll tell you about that we have some awards that we're going to be giving away uh, Jameson Rogers is going to be receiving the Northwest Young Alumni Professional oh, Achievement I love that. Award. And then we have another award that we're giving is the Alumni Professional mm -hmm. Achievement Award. And it's going to Michael Joe Cannon from Oxford, who is the owner of Cannon Motors. He is an alumnus of Northwest as well. And then we give a Spirit of Northwest Award. That is going to Jim Flanagan. He is the DeSoto County Economic Development Council President and CEO. Uh, he, uh, just is an advocate for Northwest. We're Ooh, very I love excited. That. Shine the light. Mm -hmm. Shine the light. We're very uh, excited to honor him. And then our final award is the Organization of the Year Award, and it's going to the Reedy Acres Foundation. It's a family foundation from Rada Valley, Mississippi. I love that. Showing that appreciation to keep Absolutely. it going. Absolutely. Thank it's, you, Patty. That's good. So, that's so now when do the online auction start? I'm sorry, real quick. Online auction starts on February the 26th on a Monday, and then the actual Boots and Pearls for is on Saturday night, March the 2nd. Perfect, thank you. Boots and pearls, y'all. Go ahead and get your stuff down. But it's affordable, find your gal. That's we'll right. be right back. Okay. Thank you. Blunt City Life continues with an exciting perspective to philanthropy. Stay with us.